What's up guys, welcome back to Virtual Reality. Today we will play Sirento Anti-Third on the Oculus Quest. Uh, perhaps you know this game already from the PC, but this is a different version. It's totally different. So it makes use of the 360 mode of the um, Oculus Quest. And this is a game where we have to use katanas to kill our enemies and also guns. It's a very fast game. So yeah, be prepared. My name is Voodoo. You can find everything about VR and AR on my channel. Thanks to my official Patreon sponsors, Woodgoes VR, Danke Gamer, Oppermann Events and Peter Wasmeier. Let's have some fun with the game and let's go. Voodoo.de Okay guys, welcome to the game. I already played some missions on my German channel and we have three kind of missions as it seems. Um, oh, wait, I, I will um, show you the controls. We can check a lot of stuff here. Um, show uh, enemy health bars and loot pick up text and stuff. Also we can um, change a lot of stuff in the controls uh, like uh, rotation and uh, sticky grip and we can also use um, thumbstick locomotion what I choose definitely <laughs> then we have um, master hand move mode and stuff a lot of stuff to to um, change here and then we have there's no story as it seems there is only missions so uh, let's let's check out some missions we you see we have a lot of different difficulties to choose assassinate all targets in the area okay so as you can see I have free locomotion here but I can also um, uh, teleport around and double jump and stuff and to reload we have to shake the weapon like this For me it's a little bit easier to, to play with the weapons than with the sword, but for some enemies you need the sword for the, for the boss for example, because it's much easier to kill the boss with the sword, because it makes more damage. Also this guy. Oh, now, now there's the boss, so let's get the katana. <laughs> that was easy, wasn't it? So if you try this with the sword, this is not a good idea. Uh, I mean with the weapon, sorry. Yes, that's it. <laughs> that was fast, wasn't it? So that was the assassination. I think we were very fast. Except, oh, we collected two items. Increased max size, ooh, nice. Then let's go to survival. Oh no. Uh, where, why is there German stuff? <laughs> this is uh, seems to be a little bug, I think. Oh, trigger to continue. Okay, survive for 90 seconds. Let's try. Come on. Time is counting down. Nobody's here. Okay. Stupid. Stupid idiot. Oh, this this girl is very fast. We have to be careful. Oh no. It's 
scum here. to to kill them with a with a sword but this one i think oh shit what's wrong with these guys double jump so let's it's 90 seconds wow Okay, that was not a good idea. Ooh. Oh, there's no falling damage, by the way. <laughs> Where are they? That's it? Nobody? Where are you? I can hear. Where? Do you see them? Huh? <laughs> Where the heck? Where's that coming from? Didn't they say survive 90 seconds? Where's that coming from? <gasps> Sorry guys, but I don't see this guy. Where is he? Oh, there! So this was a lie, survive 90 seconds is not enough, we also have to kill everybody. So this is not a good <laughs> mission info. And then we have the elimination. Aha. High risk. Oh, oh, only one chance. Yeah, so let's see if we can do that. Press the trigger. Okay, so we have to eliminate everybody around here. So let's check this out. Come on guys, what's what's going on? Are you afraid of me or what? Don't mind. <laughs> He's dead. Na 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 na. Come on. Where are you? So as you see, the graphics are really worse than with the PC version. Oh no. 
no. <laughs> Stupid guy. And now? Oh shit! They are strange. <laughs> nice. And now? Oh. We have only one try. What? How many guys are these? Uh oh, don't have too many shots left. We have to pick up some stuff, I think. Area cleared. That's it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, guys, that's all of the missions. Uh, I mean, all of the type of the missions, of course. We will have a, a lot more stuff, of course, here with challenges. Um, that This is like achievements. Kill three enemies in one slide and stuff. Then we have an endless mode. We can choose our loadout. And yeah, that's the next missions and operations. You see the area map here. We can go to different areas. Rewards. We can open this chest. Then we have a larger deflect area and stuff. So there is no really, there is no story or what. That's just uh, single missions. But yeah, it's cool. elimination, wave assault, and assassination. So guys, thanks for watching and. Let's go back to the studio and talk about it. Sirento VR untethered guys. So if you ask me, I'm not a fan of these kind of games. I don't like this ninja style and katana and stuff, but this is only my opinion. If you like these kind of games, this is pretty cool because the movement is so fast. And uh, if you do a double jump, uh, onto an enemy and then pull your katanas out and hit this enemy. This feels pretty cool to be honest and all this gun stuff and so on and so on. It's a fast game. It's a brutal game. Don't let your kids play that. It's, it's from 18 years and um, you have to be careful a little bit because of motion sickness. The, the whole picture is moving while you are jumping and this can cause motion sickness. So don't play this game. If you are new to VR, you can play it on the Quest and on the Rift, but be careful on the Rift, it's a total different game. So on the Quest, it's more like a mini games, several mini games. And on the, on the Rift, on the PC, this is a full game with story and stuff. So yeah, I think the 15 euro is fine. If it would be 30, I would say no, but 15, it's pretty okay. 
Sirento untethered. Guys, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. And if you want to buy my merch, you can find the link under this video. That would be awesome yeah, if you could support me. There's also a cool pillow where it says virtual reality on the back. That's pretty awesome. So if you liked the video, thumbs up and see you next time in virtual reality, guys. See ya. Voodoo